Hey guys, this is Mr. Tech Agent. It's gonna be a tutorial on how to create uh, this kind of a storefront using Adobe Illustrator. Let's get started. File new. I'm gonna take 2000 into 1800. Okay, okay, as you can see, this part, uh, the main storefront, we're gonna be using one the rectangle tool for proportions. You can hold on shift, but I don't need that because we don't want proportions well we are good to go and make one for the window and one for the D door for the D door that sounds crazy sorry for that actually I have fewer so I sound sounding kind of goofy uh, well that looks good oh shit well we are good to go now as we have got this I'm just gonna select all and go to object path and uh, offset path and I'm going to select minus 10 pixels good that looks good now the outer one as you can see I'm just gonna fill it with uh, let's say gray and the inner one I'm just gonna go gradient radial okay no no this is another thing which we want I'm just gonna take and hold on this well wow this looks pathetic I want kind of lighter oh shit sorry mm -hmm. well this looks good well now as we cut this uh, we are kind of good to go kind of okay take this and this the outer window parts and fill it with uh, darker gray looks good and this again with linear uh fill it with dark gray as i said mm -hmm. oh well this looks pretty good i'm just gonna see some. well now as we got this uh we will change the angle to 90 degrees well that's good and then I'll select these two uh, radial oh shit yeah that's true that's good <laughs> well now as we've got radial symmetry we don't want the gray color because we want cyan if you see properly uh, this color C Y A N C I don't know how to pronounce that. Sorry for that, but let's get started. Hold on, this uh, take one of this and come on. Okay, okay, this is the smacking part which I hate a lot. Okay, uh, see, you can waste your time uh, perfecting this thing. I'm not gonna do that because YouTube has only 15 minutes for me. I'm not a partner yet, so you know, kind of stuck. Okay, well, we cut the thing. Okay, I know it's not really similar, but well, I hope you guys cooperate with me. Well, I mean, I'm not satisfied with this thing, but um, I gotta just go further. Okay, now if you see this effect, the this effect uh, the, this the, I don't know the halo type thing so for that you need rectangle tool oh okay sorry uh, hold down sorry <coughs> select these two things and control plus C control plus F so we get this control plus Z to undo it so we got we just copied it in the front well uh, hold on these uh, hold down select these two things and uh, what was the thing yeah sorry it's uh, gonna take the rectangle tool or M and it's gonna make it this much 40 degrees 45 sorry 40 sounds great sounds funny well now as I've got this I'm just gonna uh, use the pathfinder well I have it here you can get it from window uh, I don't know where is it you just kind of find it yeah the here, here is it and now you can just get that without any problem well voila we got this voila that sounds funny oh my god 
Oh shit, we did a wrong step. I am sorry. Well, I'm back and uh, I just figured out what was the problem. Uh, we had to choose the intersect menu, which we didn't. And uh, now we're good to go, as you can see. But now, what you gotta do is fill this with white, and that's it. Okay, I'm just gonna take it white and take it white. Well, now I know it sounds and it looks pathetic, but that's the thing. We just gotta do like it, do, do this like that. Well, oh shit. Why am I abusing? Okay, I'm not abusing, but anyways. Oh, come on. Okay, the, the first uh, thing. I don't know what to call this, but anyways, change the opacity of this to 45. Uh, just gonna type in 45. Ooh. Ooh. And the second one, uh, we're gonna make the opacity go to null. Well, 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 this is good. But I don't want the black outline, so I'm just gonna select this and backslash. It's gone. Good. Very good. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Pretty darn good. You know. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Good. Well, now again, follow the same step. 45 degrees. Ooh, done. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry. I didn't select this. Done. Voila. Voila. I like that word a lot. I don't know if you paid attention, but we got this part. And this part. Where you can make anything right there. I don't care about that. Oh shit, sorry. Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna take the rectangle to or M. Uh, okay. Be fast, be fast, be fast. Uh, I'm gonna be grey, dark grey. Please. Please, for the mother of God. Okay. Now it. Yeah, it's good. Well, okay, that's good. Now we want this tech part. <coughs> okay, we'll waste some time afterwards and we'll make the main <coughs> ground sorry I have fever <coughs> oh my god I'm gonna get a lot of dislikes I hope not okay uh, well uh, I'm just gonna take it linear mm -hmm. now uh, I'm just gonna take the lower part a bit gray and uh, make it 90 degrees so that we get that effect well 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 we got that effect but we have to sh shift these two things in the opposite direction oh man but this is what we want this is what we really want well we made this now we have to make the tech part which is the easiest well it's not uh, the gradient on that thing is you gotta be really you know you gotta waste a lot of time making that gradient and get the perfect effect color color please uh, red uh, let's take this wow this looks good first try not bad man not bad uh, fill it with the gradient right here okay uh, radial and the other we will make uh, oh man please okay waste more waste more time that's my advice for you all guys oh sh holy holy mother of god this looks pathetic but oh man I hate this part please mm. Hold on this and get this. Well, I know, I know it's not my best, but you can waste a lot of time and get the perfection. Okay, I'm gonna write tech. I'm just gonna make it a little big. Oh man, uppercase. This is what the hell was that? Uh, go down. Oh, come on, get in proportion. Uh, we like distant galaxy, so... Good. Uh, it's gonna make it a little bit smaller. Wow, well, 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 this looks good. Uh, I don't like black, so I'm just gonna make it white. Because we want white, right? 
Oh, oh my god. Oh my god, don't hang, please. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm just gonna group this. No, I'm not gonna group it, because for this shutter... Oh, oh my god. For this uh, shutter, I gotta use the same color, so... You know, get the point right. Well, uh, I'm just gonna take it. Hold on, I'm just gonna take it. Okay, I'll make the slanting effect afterwards. Now I'm just gonna take the round rectangle tool. Well, uh, see, round rectangle tool you can manage the roundness uh, using your arrow keys up and down. I'm not gonna waste a lot of time because I have made it. <laughs> make sure your uh, this thing is taller than a little bit taller than your door. And uh, once you're done, uh, oh, you can see the color right there uh, take this color and uh, fill it with this well, uh, well what no well 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 now we don't want the upper part so this part so uh, I'm gonna cut it take the rectangle tool M uh, okay this much oh sorry man I always forget Mm -hmm. Oh no. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. Well, this looks kind of good. Copy or duplicate this thing and make it a uh, lighter gray. Oh, sh what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Okay. <coughs> uh, more two. Well, now to get that bulging effect, we're gonna use the effect and the warp. But we're gonna use the bulge warp and uh, make sure the, uh, you hit vertical. Make this 48. Sorry, make this 40. Uh, make this 28. And boom. We are. What the? Sorry, we gotta group this effect. Make sure you group that because that's the main part. You're not gonna get that effect if you don't group it. And voila, voila, voila. That sounds kind of crazy. But whatever. It's good to be crazy sometime. Okay. Well, wow. Well, now, if you are kind of that crazy guy who doesn't like making those shadows and everything, everything like that, then make sure uh, you do that. I'm not gonna waste a lot of time doing that because uh, YouTube, you know, right? Right, you guys know you can incorporate. Oh man, this looks like what type of a thing is this? Oh my god! Oh man, when I'll get a Mac next year, right? Next year, surely I'm getting a Mac, but now I gotta suffer with Windows. Okay, let's go and zoom out a bit. Now we want the background. We're gonna group this, uh, create uh, this background. Well, uh, okay, and uh, okay, well, I hope you got the thing which I was trying to do, just copy it because uh, the layer. I don't get the layers part in this thing, it sucks, so I just copied it. Well, go ahead, export it, and you'll be good to go. Hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Well, I know, I know, it kind of differs, but man, come on, what do you expect from me? Uh, I tried out like two times, and then I got the perfect, which was this one. You can waste more time to get the perfect effect. Thank you for watching. I am out of time. This was Mr. Tech Agent.